After the completion of Shenzhou 9 mission, we will prepare for the next. We will be ready for the selection of our motherland to make new contributions to China's manned space program. This was from an interview with Jin Haipeng four years ago. Now he has realized his promise. I didn't plan on being part of the Shenzhou 11 crew specifically. Being an astronaut is my post, and I always remind myself that I have to be prepared even if I would not be selected for the mission. Jin Haipeng was born in 1966. He joined the military service in 1985, and he became a part of China's first group of astronauts in 1998. After years of training, he was finally selected for the mission of Shenzhou 6 manned space flight in 2005. I didn't fly into space that time, but that didn't bother me. Maybe I wasn't ready yet. He sought guidance from his coaches and other astronauts and practiced and figured out the best ways of, for instance, improving his breathing. That's really helpful for endurance when operating spacecraft. Then, Jing joined the Shenzhou 7 and 9 missions in 2008 and 2012. In Huang's eyes, Jing's past experience and his participation in the Shenzhou 11 mission is due to his hard work and dedication. This is his third space mission, and this really proves that he has exceptional professionalism. I think during our lifetime, we need to set for us one dream after another, and one goal after another and to endeavor toward the set objective. Now, Jin Haipeng is about to realize another dream, his third space flight. He's not just happy, he also has inner peace. The Olympic Games is held every four years. I conducted my first space mission in 2008, and then again second in 2012. And now another four years has just passed. I think I need to learn from Chinese Olympic shooter Wang Yifu who has participated in nine Olympic Games. I still have a long way to go.